Charlie Cook's favourite books. And I think these are all Charlie Cook's favourite books. So we've got one that's got a pirate on it, Shiver Me Timbers, Fairy Tales from a Forgotten Island, and it's got a mouse on it, The Vero Annual, and it's got a bear, Joust Joking, I think that might be a dragon down the bottom there, Incredible Stories of Real Birds, A Country Childhood, Improving Stories for Wicked Thieves, my first encyclopedia, and Out of This World, a collection of ghost stories. Charlie Cook's favourite books. Once upon a time there was a boy called Charlie Cook who curled up in a cosy chair and read his favourite book. About a leaky pirate ship which very nearly sank, and the pirate chief who got the blame and had to walk the plank. The chief swam to an island and went digging with his hook. At last he found a treasure chest and in it was a book. About a girl called Goldilocks and three indignant bears who cried, who's had our porridge? Who's been sitting on our chairs? They went into the bedroom and baby bear said, look, she's in my bed and what is more, she's got my favorite book. About Sir Percy Pilkington, a bold and fearless knight who told the dragon, wait, I'm not quite ready for the fight. You must hear this one first. And then his armour clanked and shook as he read aloud a joke he found inside his favourite book. About Rowena read a lot, a very well-read frog who jumped upon a lily pad and jumped upon a log, who jumped into the library which stood beside the book and went read it, read it, read it as she jumped upon a book. About an oak tree full of birds, each bird had built a nest they had a competition to decide which one was best. They chose an owl to judge it, and the winner was a rook, whose nest was lined with pages from his very favourite book. About a girl who saw a flying saucer in the sky. Some small green men were in it, and they waved as they flew by. She tugged her mother's sleeve and said, Look, Mum, what I've just seen. But Mum said, Hush, I'm trying to read my favourite magazine. About a wicked jewel thief who stole the king's best crown, but then got stuck behind some sheep which slowed his car right down. The king dialed 999 and soon the cops had caught the crook and flung him into prison where he read his favourite book. About a greedy crocodile who got fed up with fish and went on land to try to find some other kind of dish. He went into a bookshop and there grew even greedier when reading on page 90 of a large encyclopedia. About the biggest birthday cake the world had ever seen, a team of royal cake makers had made it for the Queen. The cake was so delicious that a famous spaceman took a slice of it to Jupiter. He also took a book. About a ghost who glided round a castle every night, carrying her head and giving everyone a fright. She kept it up till morning, then she found a shady nook and put her head back on again to read her favourite book. About a cosy armchair and a boy called Charlie Cook. And those again are all of Charlie Cook's favourite books. I hope you enjoyed story time today. Thank you so much for joining us. See you next time.